Porter, sorry I'm late. Yes, you can call the meeting to order. At 645. Okay. Hi, Nick. Hi, Carrie Ann. Hello. Minutes. I read the minutes and the executive minutes, and I thought they were fine. I make a motion. Do we accept the minutes of Monday, October 19th, the regular Second. meeting, and Second. the executive meeting? Second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Three nothing. Nice minutes, Carrie Ann. Thank you. Sorry for getting them out so late. Psh. It's way better than I do. Here you go, dear. Oh. Thank you, sir. Flying well, on, we have uh, fiscal year 2021 DLS gateway documents. Yeah. So I was just talking with them. I didn't know if you guys have to physically sign them or if it's okay that I stamp them. You guys just have to do something before I submit them. I'm going to submit them tomorrow. So right. um, I'm going to reach out to Lauren. But otherwise, Carrie Ann, Carrie Ann, you said stamp them? I, I mean, if it's okay with Bill and Greg, I say stamp them. Okay. And talk to Lauren, you know, and submit. And, you know, maybe throw an email out to Lauren saying, you know, is a stamp? okay or do they need to come and sign Greg if you can sign tonight I know Bill said you can't sign until the end of the week and if Nicole is willing to meet me at the town hall uh, one night I can go in and sign that's fine by me okay I'll also reach out to um, Laura too about it because now I have to like like I just came in to scan it that document that gives you guys gives me permission to sign on behalf of you guys right so I don't know if that covers it as well, um, but I will reach out to see if you guys have to physically sign the paper forms. Um, I think it might be nice to put in just one sentence in the uh, minutes saying that we gave uh, Nicole permission to stamp this document. I know we've given permission previously, but so we can specifically say it's for this document. Okay. Okay. That works. And do you Carrie Ann, do you guys usually sign that LA LA three two? That's what's like so. all the sale dates. Like it's quite a few pages long. Yeah, I believe we. I believe you know. Just we reviewed it. You, you signed it. I think we have to sign it on yeah. Gateway, right? Yeah, I'm looking at that now. All right. All right. So I'll have Greg sign it. I won't stamp it until I talk to Lauren. Because I don't want to ruin it. Right. So does that mean we need to come in and use that signature thing that we have a code for? No, no, that's after um, the classification hearing. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. 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 So, Greg, I will have you then sign. There's four different documents. This is the LA-13, which is the sales data. LA-3. Is it the LA3? LA3. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. That was the LA3. I have too many things in my hands. And here is the LA13. Alex, this is what we do for excitement. Hmm. We sign forms. Can I give you both the agendas? Oh, it's over there. And then these are the other two. LA-15 and LA-4. Sounds right. For the purposes of the viewing public, we have to submit these documents in order to prove the tax base that the town of Granby is dealing with. This is like if our taxes are going to go up or not, right? N Nicole? Yeah. I have a question on the LA-3. It's kind of minor. Okay. But, but if one of these, I don't know, it's on the, about 10 or 12 down. 
It says the street name Fox Hill. There's no street in Granby called Fox Hill. You're there is a, a, a mound called Fox Hill, but there's no street. Fox Hill is actually off Taylor Street. Yep, you're right. You're right on that one. That piece of property is, it does not have any frontage on any road, so that's why it's called Fox Hill. Really? So that's not connected with the other piece of property that, that Jill bought? It is connected, but it's a separate parcel. Oh, I didn't realize that. We good? Bill, you good? Bill, you good on that question? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I guess I'm not. I, it's it's fine. I just just because they're connected, I don't know why it's not Taylor Street then. Uh, it's I, just. I'm not going to argue with it. Just right. No, that's just how it's been in our system. Like there's other ones with other weird names that I've never heard of either. If they're okay, like in well, the middle. That's the only one I've seen so far. I believe they're paper streets. That's why. Okay. Until the building inspector assigns uh, uh, a number to them. Well, you or can't. until the builder decides to do something. Like right. That. Right. Yeah, because right. there's no. Either or. There's no part. That's yeah. in the middle of yeah. nowhere. All right. Now we have to sign certificates for Chapter 61 Forest Land for Shailoski and Sons. Yep. Is this uh, another parcel yeah, or something? Long there, long email from him. Oh. Well, she loves him. I don't even know if I've ever met him in person. So these are the certificates. They're up for forest, you know, because renewal of the forest. Renewal, land. yeah. So they've applied, and these are their certificates. So I know it says signed by chairman, but I'm assuming it's okay for you to sign them. Either or, or uh, Bill, are we still on for some time this week? Uh, Greg, I need to tell you that. No, I'm going to Pennsylvania in the morning, and I won't be back till Friday. Thank All God. Right. <laughs> I'm not prepared for you, so I'm so I don't Nicole feel guilty is at all. Set. all. I don't feel guilty at all. <laughs> Let's what get did a I do just get Nicole off the hook. Yes, yes you did. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it so much. Like, whoo. I just lost 10 pounds. It's amazing. But, but Greg, I'm willing to do it next Wednesday if that's okay with you. Okay. That's fine by me. I'm going to try and get Nicole to get some paperwork together for me for Wednesday. Oh, um, just to be a pain. Five more pounds back on. <laughs> Somebody's got to be a pain, and I'm a natural. Well, and I also have questions like, are you, you guys are going to pick and choose what streets you want. Like, you're not just going to go in order? You're going to go we'll discuss it? it later. Let's just go in order. That would make it easier, you know? All right, so what have you got? Those so are these the, are the That's the chapter land so that is supposed to be uh, signed by the chair, but Bill, since you're leaving in the morning, I'll sign it for you. Thank you. So there's three for each one, if you would mind. Three signatures for each one? Yeah. Are you freaking kidding we me? We keep one when... You're lucky I'm on air. I know. I swear I to God, Bill. Like where did you drag it up? Have you ever seen this kind of exciting hours? Really? Nope. It's amazing. Two. I just never stopped giving out. You notice that? <laughs> I do notice that. Sometimes she has to take, um, as in the phone call.
Thank you. All set with chapter lien. Thank you. All the certificates. So the certificates. Did we want to go into then discussing one of the parcels for the Shailowski then? Uh, do we have anything more to discuss in a regular meeting? Um, I'd like to do that before we. Uh, well, yeah, was, we should do all that beforehand. So is the Sh is the Shailowski question a executive question or is it a normal question? I think it's an executive session question. Okay. All right. All right, so then the only other thing was I informed you guys about the MAAO Fall Conference. The price yeah. is going to be $60 per member, um, and it is on Zoom. Did either of you guys want to go? Carrie Ann did say interest in it, so then I was also going to be informed as well. Carrie Ann, are you still interested? Yes, I am. Okay. All right, I will probably not be available no matter how interested I am. Nicole, you and Carrie Ann can go. And okay. we'll pick your brain. Okay. So I will register us tomorrow, Carrie Ann? Okay. Um, yeah. Before you register us, just reach out to me and I can give you my work email because I'll probably do it through that. Okay, perfect. And then we'll just uh, postpone these. Uh, issues that the uh, Economic Development Committee is asking us, Yes. although they asked me again at our la la latest meeting about any um, anything we might be considering doing to promote economic development along 202. So somewhere in the next meeting or two, I think we should at least just slightly discuss, we should start discussing that. And that's fine. Um, we, ac we actually discussed it before, but continue our discussion. Right. Has this committee met recently yeah can I, yeah we met last tuesday and we're meeting it we're meeting once a month now we, we've started up meeting again the last i think three months we're meeting once a month on the last tuesday of the month and i don't know if you can answer this but um what sort of agenda does the committee have uh, we're talking about a lot of different things um, this is just one of the things on the agenda. All right. Um, in terms of us having an impact on tax revenue or tax liability, I, I guess is the gist of what they're looking from us. Is that correct? Yes, they're looking from us if, if the assessors would be open to have some sort of um, tax incentive initially for businesses that want to build and come into Granby. Not move, not move into Granby in an existing building, but develop land and put a building up on it for a new business. So this is something where they would, be, they would want to do a TIF. I'm See, sorry, Carrie, would want to do what? Is this what they? Is this where they would want to possibly enter into a TIF where yes, they yes. would? Okay. They're, they're they're just looking to us for, for the direction that we might offer to oh, build new businesses that are, that are okay. building and moving into town. Harry, and refresh my memory on what a TIF is. So, if somebody was to come in and buy land. Um, it, it can go different ways, let me say it that way. So if someone was to come in and buy land and want to build a building, uh, we could take a certain percentage every year on that building. So they wouldn't be assessed the full value right away. We would slowly increase to maybe 25% one year, 50% the next year, 75% and then 100%. Or it just depends on what is agreed upon. Right. You just want to set okay. them at the full value of the building right away. And it could TIF. Be a 10 year agreement. If, you know, it all right. is what okay. the town and the new owner of the property building a business would want to enter into. Right. Um, and TIF stands for what? Oh, you had to ask me that. See? Because uh, <laughs> I think it was a tax. Well, I'm, I'm going to go home and look it up anyways. 
I think I sent you guys a nice yarn it once upon a time, and I tend to. I'm sure you did. Yeah, I, you did carry in, and I have it in my my file here on my computer. But I, yes, you did send that. All right. Well, I'll just it's a have tax to. Tax incentive. Something. Right. I got the TI. I don't have. The Look tax. at you. Yeah. We, I've got a resource manager that can answer that right here. I believe it should uh, go. It should pronounce uh, tax in increasement financing. Tax uh, increasement financing. It's a public finance method that is used as a subsidy for redevelopment infrastructure and other community improvement projects in many countries, including the United States. That might be a national thing that we stole the acronym for. But it might not be. All right. Thank you. Um, yes, we should plan on our, at our next meeting getting getting a formal reply to. Um, I don't care. I'm not sure we're going to be ready to get a reply after next meeting, but at least we'll get the ball rolling again. All right. It's. I'm going to interrupt you guys. A tip is a tax increment finance. Thank you. You're welcome. You're the best. Yeah, tax increment finance. You know, it is a word if I just read it wrong. I'm sure there's different whatevers too. Alright, do we have any other business for the regular meeting? I'm not aware of anything. We have our next meeting scheduled. Yes. Is everyone okay with that next meeting date and Maybe time? Maybe even 6.30. If Alex calls me, I'll, I'll probably oh. make it on time. Well, you ignored my phone calls, so. though. Right. What's the difference? Well, I'm doing it in stereo now. <laughs> All right. In that case, uh, Alex, we're going to adjourn this meeting at 7.03.